What's up you guys? Welcome back to another Roblox video. Today we're going to be playing this Grand School Escape Obby. Listen to the teacher, don't run away, don't argue, and don't doubt because nothing will happen to you. Listen to the teacher. Um, is that the teacher? The big giant red monster? All right guys, here we go. So is that the teacher? That that lady right there? The most boring class. Example one, how many hedgehogs can fly 100 kilometers per hour if the camel is blue and costs $1? If there's one thing I don't miss about school, it's questions like that. I'm not even going to attempt to solve that. If you guys know the answer, comment down below and hit the like button because here we go. We got to do easy mode. They have medium, hard, impossible, and Superman mode. How hard is this obby going to be? Okay, so we're stuck in school, and we need to escape. We're stuck in this classroom, it looks like. So oh. 3, oh, man, this sounds so boring. Okay. Oh, the monster! What's it go? Yo, guys, our teacher, she's gone. She oofed. <laughs> Everyone's panicking. Oh, no. How are we going to get out of here? Everyone calm down, okay? I will think of a plan. I'll think of something. Let me just uh, let me just talk to this guy. Look at all the students. They're terrified. They're so scared. Let's talk to this guy. It was so scary. I don't know what happened. The door is locked. Press the fire alarm. Maybe it will open the door. Okay, the fire alarm. Guys, I have an idea. I'm just going to go ahead and pull the fire alarm down. Uh-oh. Here we go. The sprinkler system is flooding the hallways now that we pulled the fire alarm. What's this apple over here? Do I have to grab this? We got... Oh, we got a snack award. Let's talk to this girl. Collect all the apples and become stronger. Apples will give you power for the boss fight. Yo! Okay, so if we get 24 apples, I guess we're gonna have a lot more strength or some kind of superpower to defeat a boss. And if I had to guess, the boss is probably going to be that big red scary monster thing. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this apple right here and probably not try to step in the water because I'm sure we're going to get zapped. Now, is this is this like my, my hearts or my lives? I have like 30 of them, dude. I don't think I got to worry about anything if I have that many lives. Just got to make sure I get all the apples. Oh, we got one up here. Nice. And I don't know if we're supposed to be, like, running from the monster. Because he, he grabbed our teacher. And I'm sure he ate her. And he's probably really hungry still. So he's probably going to try to eat us. Can I talk to this guy? Flasks with acid are broken. Don't touch the liquid. Did I just see the monster? Bro, the monster's trying to grab all the students. Be careful the monster can grab you. Yeah, I can see that, dude. So what happens if we actually get taken by the monster? I want to see if anything happens. Is he going to rip us out of the window? Let me just stand here and wait. Let's wait. Oh, <laughs> let's wait for the monster. Oh, oh, he actually hurt you, dude. Look how many hearts I just lost. So even though we have a whole bunch of hearts, if the monster touches us one time, he takes away like five hearts every single time. And I only have like one more chance to not get hit by the monster. That is not good. I didn't see any apples in there. So hopefully, oh, I missed one. Guys, I gotta go back. We gotta go back and grab this apple, dude. How did I not see this before? I was so distracted by the giant monster arm. Uh-oh, this is a long open hallway. Is this gonna be a chase? Are we gonna get chased by... Oh, no, we're gonna get chased by the monster, dude. Oh, my gosh, he's huge. <laughs> he looks like a red Sully from Monsters, Inc. Kinda. Um, okay, he's actually chasing me. Oh, I'm running. Okay, so it looks like I just have to, like, avoid all these objects here. All the, the fallen lockers. Look how big that monster is, dude. He's so big because he's eating all the students. And the more students he eats, the bigger he gets. And then we got to defeat him at the very end. But you're not going to get me, dude. I got Nikes on. You ain't catching me. I'm fast. I'm faster than Sonic. Ooh. The whole hallway collapsed on him. He's not going to be able to get us now. Well, he's probably strong enough to get out of all that. So he's probably going to like wait for us at the very end. 
Hopefully we don't have to run away from him again. Because I'm really weak. But it looks like, oh, the apples give you the hearts. So even though we lost some hearts, I don't think that we have to get all 24. I'm pretty sure we just have to make sure that our hearts are like fully upgraded before the boss battle. Look at this guy. He's eating a cheeseburger with his eyes closed. He's like sleeping and eating a cheeseburger when there's this monster trying to eat all the students at the school. Dude, take that cheeseburger with you, okay? You don't have to sit down and eat at the cafeteria. You, <laughs> you should be running away with us. What are you doing? Do you not care about your life? You need to run. We gotta make it through the cafeteria, guys. We are in the back of the kitchen. And it looks like the stove caught on fire because there's something wrong with the electricity after we pulled the fire alarm. And that's what's causing all this crazy stuff to happen. All the knives are swinging and falling. Oh, it looks like we just have to avoid, like, right where the line is. So let's go now. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna get my head chopped off by this knife. And we got the, the flames. The flames from the stove. Okay, let's jump on this book. And then on this, oh, I took some damage. Wait, I'm not supposed to be down. I'm not supposed to be down here. I saw a checkpoint. I'm supposed to go up there. Okay, so right here, I think we need to jump on these opening drawers. I thought that they were going to try to push us off. There we go. We got the checkpoint. Nice, dude. Wait, wait, I'm going to die. Oh, I got to jump up here. This is kind of confusing. How did you get up there so fast? You guys are pros at this. You're pros at escaping school, but you don't want to escape school, okay? School is supposed to be a safe, fun place. And definitely don't skip class. You got to go to class and you got to learn and you got to eat your apples. And that's exactly what I'm doing. Unless there's like a giant creepy monster in your school, then yeah, you might want to run. But for now, I got to try to run through this maze, dude. It's showing two ways for us to go. I don't know which way is the right way. I'm just going to keep guessing left or right. Uh, Well, that guy just came from the left side. I guess I'll go right because he probably hit a dead end unless this takes us to a circle. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. Well, we got an apple, but there's... There's prison bars right there. We're locked in the vents. I don't even think we're we're halfway. I think we got to get like right there. Oh, why did I jump into that that buzzsaw when I just saw him do it? Okay, it's saying that we need to go down here. Finally, dude. Please tell me this is the right way. This is actually kind of challenging. And we're on easy mode. But look, we got all of our hearts back to health here. But it looks like this room is completely on fire. The monster is burning the school down. Go! I still don't know what I'm doing. Am I even going the right way? Oh, nice. We made it. Whoa, what is this? Is this the gym? Let's talk to this guy. Don't give up. You're doing great. Um, don't you want to escape? Are you the gym teacher? Yeah, I think that's our gym teacher. So it looks like the gym teacher is actually helping all the students escape because he wants to make sure everybody gets out safely before he gets out safely. This is his gym class after all, so... Ooh, he definitely knows the way out of here. He'll be all right. Let's grab this, and let's jump up here because I see another apple. We're taking some damage every time that we step on the lava. Oh, the whole place is catching on fire. I'm scared. I'm scared. Yes, another checkpoint. Take the basketball and throw the basketball into the hoop. All right, let me go for a three-pointer. I used to be an amazing basketball player back in the day. Three points! Come on, man, quit playing with me. I got the basketball skills. I know what I'm doing when it comes to gym class, okay? I'm an athlete. What does this say? Take the object. Okay, and it looks like we might have to put the shapes where they go. Whoa, but we don't want to fall off of this because it'll push us right into the lava. Ooh, why do we got to do gym class stuff? This is an emergency. We shouldn't be doing obstacles. The gym teacher is definitely putting us to the test. He wants to see how good our parkour skills are. Okay, so it looks like we just have to put this one here, the triangle, and then we're gonna put the circle where it goes. I don't know what the point of this is. I'm pretty sure we only need this one. So let's see what happens when we put this where the circle goes. That just, oh, it was like a, a lever, I guess, that opened up that wall. I have no idea. Get me out of here. This gym class is crazy, bro. Don't fall. We've worked so hard. Let's go. Now we go this way. I think we're jumping on chalk. 
It's kind of what that looks like. I like that that painting. Cool. Number one. Okay, let's grab this checkpoint and talk to this guy. He probably knows the way out of here. Oh, this is the coach. To beat the monster, throw stones at him. The monster hits the ground, so keep moving and don't let him hit you. Is this the end? It only says we're halfway there. I think this might be the end. We got to defeat the boss. The big red evil monster. Oh, look at him. Whoa, guys, he got even bigger because he ate more students. So we got to throw rocks at him. Where are the rocks? Uh oh, oh, maybe he's going to. Yeah, I was going to say, maybe he's going to lift rocks off of the ground. Hit him with the rocks. Yes. Come on, dude. Give me your best shot. Is that really all you got? This is easy. Give me some more rocks. Oh, he heard me call him easy. And now, I think I just took damage. Why am I invisible? He's going crazy now. My character is invisible, dude. <laughs> what the heck is going on? Hit him with more rocks. Take that, you big evil furry monster. Why are you trying to eat all the students, dude? We got plenty of cheeseburgers and slices of pizza in the cafeteria. You don't gotta eat the students. Yes, we did it! Is he defeated? Oh no. I fell down a hole. I don't think we escaped, did we? Wait a second, we got the graduate award, the underground award, and the safe award. Everything has fallen underground. Now we're in a cave, you must go further. There's something there. So that wasn't the end. We gotta go through this cave. Guys, I think we might only be halfway there. We're underneath the school. We're under, the, like, the playground right now. She said that there's something over here. Is it this coin? Or is it something else? Oh, I see another apple, but I don't think I really need it. I don't think it's really going to give me anything. I just got to try to get through this cave. Look at the monster. He's on the wall. This might be his home. Why are those people bowing to him? They're bowing to the evil, the evil red monster. Let's talk to this girl. These platforms are unstable. They can disappear. Jump fast and be careful. Okay. I don't think we're getting out of here anytime soon. Not unless we get out of this crazy cave. So apparently the, the platforms, they're disappearing. So you can't really stay on them for that long. You got to make sure that you just keep jumping. Oh, I almost fell. Come on. Yes. I do not want to fall in the lava. Ooh. I think I'm in first place. I'm like in the, the very front of the obby right now. So we're going to be on our own. We're not really going to have any friends with us for a while. What is he doing? Is he just like sitting? It's a very strange pic picture of the monster. I don't know why there's so many paintings of Mr. Red Monster. I do not want to fall. Oh man, look at that drop down there. That's just like a void. There's nothing even over there. Do I gotta wait for this? Okay, we're gonna jump on this. Take this over here, and then we can get another checkpoint. I shouldn't have jumped. Look at my head. It popped right off. What did I do wrong over here? I think I just jumped way too fast. So we're gonna go like that, and then we have to wait until that gets really close. Like right here. Nice. Okay, there is another apple down there. I'm not going to get it. We have too much work to do still. What is this? Oh, no, guys. Oh, a giant boulder. It just squished that guy. Oh, no, dude. I think we're supposed to hide. I don't know where, though. Oh, right here, right here, right here. The boulder's coming back. Here it comes. See, we probably just want to, like, run right behind it. Is that catnap behind me? Come on, catnap. We can do this, dude. We just got to wait for the boulder to pass. How am I going to get away from the boulder? When there's giant things of lava right below my feet. Where do I hide? Oh, down here. Here it comes. Right over our head. Ooh, we almost got squished like a bug. Ooh, big lava area. Oh, I slipped right into it. No! Oh, I'm gonna die. Um, okay. My face just got burned by all that fire. So there's fire that comes through this rock up here. We got to make sure that we don't step on that until the fire goes away. Where is it? Oh, here it comes. Yeah, look at that. You got to wait until it kind of like erupts. And then it's safe to cross. Oh, I see the monster up there, but I think it's just a statue. Oh, the fire's coming again. We got to wait. Got to wait for the fire to pass. 
Yeah, look at the crazy monster statue. This is like his dungeon. The monster lava dungeon. It's almost like we're in some kind of pyramid now. Oh, look. Is that Anubis? What's he doing? He's... I, I think he's like tickling the monster. I don't really know what the heck's going on <laughs> on that picture. But I'm just going to say he was tickling him. Did I just run in a circle? Or do I... Oh, maybe I have to go down. Yeah, wait. Can I just jump? No, if I jump down there, I'm not going to be able to make it across. We got we to gotta go over here. They made it so that you can't cheat. The monster is very smart. Oh, man, he's blocking the exit. But if this isn't the end, I don't think we're ever getting out of here. Let's do this, Mr. Monster. You thought that you could come back after I hit you with those rocks? Let me get some more rocks, though, because I kind of want to throw them at your head again. Whoa, dude, he's starting to chase us now. Oh, no, maybe we have to, like, try to make him run into the door? Let's see. Oh, we got more rocks over here. Okay, let's go ahead and pick these up. Pick up the rocks before he charges at us. Oh my gosh, he's huge. He's huge, dude. Take that. Can you move, though? I gotta grab this one, too. Yeah, I gotta grab this and throw this one at your head. There we go. Bonk right on. Oh, right in the T. That probably hurt. He's not really taking much damage from these rocks. I need more. Here we go. We got one right here. Ah! He definitely got a lot stronger because these rocks are not hurting him the way that they used to. He's in his final form. That's why he's so strong. But he's only halfway defeated. We only got to hit him with maybe like five or six more of these rocks. We got, oh, we got three of them up here. Let's go. Two more maybe? Let's see. One. Yes, two. Ah! Take that. He's like, oh no. That hurt. We got the exorcism award. What? The exorcism. That wasn't an exorcism. I just hit him with some rocks. No biggie. But it looks like oh, we're going through some kind of like bunker now with lasers. This is the final security system of the school. The monster had this planned out all along, didn't he? He knew that we would go to school and we would never escape. But little did he know Tussie Games was going to school today. So, of course, I'm escaping. You can't stop me, dude. What the heck is this? It's like a, a toxic room. It's got, like, toxic acid in here. So, maybe we gotta climb these shelves and get to the other side? Yeah, we gotta go over this way. Jump on this stuff. This is like a nuclear base. Under... Underground. Which is under the school. So, guys, this is like the monster's bunker that's underneath the underground of the school. I know it's kind of confusing, but I didn't make the rules, okay? The monster did. Look how it says version is not approved because this one has four eyes. And look, he's happy up top. So somebody else created him. He's literally a creation. Do you think maybe like the, the principal did it or something? Maybe somebody else that works for the school? I hope that we can find out at the end. Unless we just have to use our imagination. I don't know. Maybe it was like Anubis from the, the pyramids that did it. Who knows? But I'm ready to escape. Come on, man. Get me out of here. This is crazy. And I'm still the only one here. All the other students are still getting eaten alive by, by the monster. I see a helicopter. Is that going to take us out? I see the light. Let's go! And we're getting so close to the checkpoint. Not the checkpoint, but the, the finish line. The green flag. I can't believe I thought that, like, halfway was the end of the obby. That was crazy. Look at us flying the copter. I don't even have my pilot's license. I don't know how I'm flying a helicopter, but I figured it out. We escaped. But I didn't get to escape with anybody else, unfortunately. So hopefully all my other friends are okay. You guys, this was an awesome... Abby, I like the monster. I like how he was, uh, he was, like, created by something, but I guess we didn't get to figure out who he was created by. If you guys want to see more awesome obbies like this, hit that like button. Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Peace!